Another beautiful day on my walk. Today, I'm in Manga and um, I want to talk about something real fast. I want to talk about comparison. You know, because we always want to compare our journey to others or we always want to gauge our journey to other people to see if we're adequate. That's really all it is, you know? And I think when you do that, you kind of destroy in your mind how your journey is depicted, basically. When I say that, I give you an example. So for all dreams, right? I have not been able to raise like VC money from outside venture capitalists, outside angel investors that I don't know. And it's this, it's this, this white girl that's on the internet pretty popular on YouTube and also uh, Instagram and she has a company and she has a co-founder and her company raised over a million dollars and I would say that company is not anywhere as It's not anywhere that has more potential than all dreams and it's not like they had like a bunch of sales it's not like they had a bunch of data it's not like they had a bunch of traction but they raised a million dollars you know as we right now all dreams we scrape by to get our platform built and scrape by like bootstrapping everything I can compare and say, yo, damn, like we should have a million dollars in VC. For one, I'm a black guy and everyone knows that black people don't get VC money, like white people get VC money. Not to mention I'm a black man, whereas she's a white woman. Now, what if I just compare myself to her and just really got down in the, on myself almost to the point to I'm like, man, this will never work. And, you know, just basically questioning myself and questioning my journey because I don't have what she has which is funding, which all businesses need. Funny thing about it, this same girl, they got, she got a million in funding and then she got the opportunity to pivot and change her business completely, right? Got the opportunity to say, hey, this isn't working, so I'm going to change my business completely. You're able to do that when you have a million dollars in, C capital, pre C capital, right? But again, if I compare my journey to hers, it takes away from my own personal journey. And you never want to do that because your personal journey is always isolated to you, right? You never want to look at someone and say, let me gauge how good I am off of them or let me gauge what I'm supposed to have off of them. You have to just run your own race. You have to do your own thing, continue to believe in yourself, continue to believe in your journey that you are on the right path. Do not compare. 
they say comparison uh comparing is like the thief of joy or something like that right that's what they say i'll go further than that just don't compare <laughs> you know because your journey is isolated to you and i've said this over and over again is the most unique thing that you have is your personal experience and personal journey that's isolated to you that's what makes you unique even talking about like in sports right so yo i used to do this a lot okay i'm a 6'6 six, six guard i'm left-handed i can do this this and that why am i not getting that shot that this guy has i'm just as good as this guy or i'm better than this guy um so why am i not getting that look from that big school and maybe it's not meant for you to get that look from that big school maybe if you go to that school maybe your whole career derails maybe you don't get what you thought you were going to get from being at that big school so you just have to believe in your journey man like like that's what i'm trying to say just believe in your journey like man what i know that we should have a million dollars in funding to run all dreams because it's going to be a hundred million dollar company but what do i do do i just continue to compare and say hey jay hoovy got five million and they didn't have much traction or this person got one million or this person got a half a million or these people made tech stars and my company is better no i'm just believing in my journey and i'm believing in where i'm at right now and believing that that's exactly where i'm supposed to be all right guys i'm out man i'm going to eat and i'll see you guys tomorrow peace